This is the best base location I have found so far in Sons of the Forest. It is on an island, which is right here. Hold on. All the way out. There's your orientation, so you can see what I'm talking about. This is the best spot I have found so far to build a base. There are two caveats to building out here. Well, there's actually three. One, it's hard to get logs out here. First method, zip line. In order to use the zip line, you're going to need the rope gun, which is in one of the caves. And I think I got company. Maybe not. The second way you can get logs is by doing the duplication glitch, which place the log down, take a stick, prop up the log, now knock it over. Look, you have two logs. There's a second way. You're really limited by those two options to get logs out here because there's only about four trees when you arrive out here at the beginning. If you want to build a massive compound, I suggest having some friends to help you out. Second caveat, it's going to be hard to get food and as you can see, I'm hungry right now. Just due to the lack of points of interest near this location, there is this marker right here in front of us, which I believe is the food and drink bunker. There are also a couple other spots around on the paths. However, if you have Dear Calvin here, you can have him fish. I don't know if he can do it during the winter. I haven't asked him to do so. But we will see if he is able to fish in the winter. Oh, he shook his head yes. Where's he going to go? So if he can get fish, that is a solution to the food problem. I feel like there is a mutant underneath the ice because it has been making weird noises for the last at least 20 minutes. Either way, third caveat to building out here, right? They can attack you. They, as in Carl the Cannibal and his mutant buddies, or Mikey the Mutant, however you want to identify them as, they can attack you during the winter because the lake is frozen over, as you can see. However, they cannot attack you during the other three seasons. So I'd say that's pretty good to have a base that they can only attack you at for one out of the four seasons, unlike everywhere else on the map where they can attack you all year round and they come with a vengeance after a certain amount of time. Look at that. He brought us fish during the winter. Oh, I can't put that on there. There we go. Solution to the food problem. Here is what I have built so far. It's just a little cabin. I like to keep it small, right? Plus, if they glitch in here like they have all my other bases, they'll get stuck, which is perfect. Keep my stuff in here. As you can see, I have went and collected quite a few uh, Fruit Loops there and some ramen noodles. You know, they're not using the real names for copyright reasons, but it'd be more immersive if they actually called the fruity cereal Fruit Loops. Look at Calvin, just a fishing machine. Virginia, however, has not came in over came over here at all. She has stayed at the first base I built when I became friends with her. She doesn't seem to leave there. Might be a glitch, might not be. I'm not sure. But this is my base. This is the best location I have found so far. Let me know if you would like more Sons of the Forest videos, right? Because I'm... Oh, no, no, no! What did I do? Well, I'm... Okay, 